ಬಂದೇ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದು ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ಬಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ಬಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕಾ ಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಶಾ ಕಲ್ಪತರು ಕೃಪಾಸಿಂಧು ಪತಿತನ ಪಾವನೆಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವಿಭೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮುಕ್ಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗು ಲಂಘಯತಿ ಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ ಕಿಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ವಂದೆ ಪರಮಾನಂದು ಮಾಧವ ವೃಂದಾವಿ ತುಳಸಿ ದೇವೈ ಪ್ರಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಸಷ್ಣಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೇ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರಂಚಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಚಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರು ಭಕ್ತಿ ಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದರನ್ನ ಧ್ಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟೋಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವ ವಿರಿಂಚನು ಶರಣ್ಯ ವೇತ್ತಾತ್ಮ ಪುನದುಪಾಲಭವಾಧಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷತೆ ಚರಣಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನಖಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರ್ಜಿತ ಕಮಿ ಗೋಧುಷ್ವದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾ ಕಿಪಾಂ ಕರೋಸಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದಿ ಗೌರವಕ್ತಬಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿ ದಿವ್ಯಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಿ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ ಸದಾ ನರ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭೂಷಿತ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಮನಂಗೋಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶುಷ್ಯುವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀಜಸ್ಸಿ ಯಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತಿ ದಯ ಸಂಬೀದ ನಿಸಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೋ ಕನಕಾ ಬುಧಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈ ಕವಿತರೋ ಕಮಲಾಯುತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೋ ದಿಜವರು ಜುಗಧಾಮಪಾಲೋ ಬಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ ಪ್ರಿಯ ಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರೋ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಗೋಲುಕಧಾಮ ನಿಜಧಾಮ ನಿತಲೆ ಚ 
जतस्सो देवी महेशो हरिधाम सुतेषु तेषु ते ते प्रभावन चया विहिताश्च जेनो गोविंदमादिपुरुषम तमहम भजामि गोलोको नामने निज धामनी तले चतस्सो देवी महेशो हरिधाम सुतेषु तेषु ते ते प्रभाव निचया विहितश्च जेनो गोविंदमादि पुरुषम तमहम भजामि गौरीय गोष्ठीपति गौरीय गोष्ठीपति शिशिला भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर प्रभुपाद परमहंस जगतगुरु टोल्ड दैट संबंध ज्ञान संबंध ज्ञान when it is there inside our heart when it is not at all manifested inside our heart hari bhajan is not at all possible to start it is not at all possible to start hari bhajan prabhupad bhakti siddhant saraswati ko swami thakur prabhupad paramans jagat guru told that without sambandh gyan without the manifestation of sambandh gyan inside your heart when it is not at all manifested inside your heart up till that point hari bhajan actual hari bhajan it is not at all started there is no question of starting hari bhajan and sambandh when you are actually getting that sambandh gyan when you actually the sambandh gyan getting manifested inside your heart when slowly steadily you are doing bhajan under the guidance of guru vaishnav maybe uh, after getting that nitya seva prapti or bhagavat charan prapti you can get before that it is not at all possible by sambandh gyan what do you mean by that sambandh gyan what do you mean by that sambandh gyan means that with bhagwan that what kind of uh, relationship i have with bhagwan that who i am in actual that who is bhagwan in actual and what i have relationship with bhagwan that from where actually bhagwan is doing his leela in the nitya dham that how i can go there in that nitya dham that what is maya why maya actually by the actual effect of maya has so much effect on us how why maya has so much effect on me that bhagwan that in he is the in, master of infinity world that i have relationship with him but i am just getting into the forgetful position definitely relationship is there but how to realize that kind of relationship with bhagwan that is a big thing that i have that uh, relationship with maya and what is the actual relationship of maya with bhagwan and this all things these all things which are there these in order to understand that actual hari bhajan hari bhajan is possible without that hari bhajan is not at all possible that's why in the kirtan it is already written sambandh janiya bhajite bhajite abhimano that me and mine this kind of false ego which we have this all false ego will definitely go away by when we'll be getting that sambandh gyan by doing seva by doing uh, knowing the sambandh gyan slowly steadily when we going ahead in our bhajan that bhagavat charan prapti that uh, nitya seva bhagwan everything we is all actually uh, uh, is uh, very what is the actual uh, uh, thing for bhagavat prapti what is the actual thing for bhagavat prapti that is only one that when you know the actual relationship with bhagwan and then under the guidance of pure guru vaishnav you are doing hari bhajan that the, to do bhagwan bhagwan seva bhagwat seva that is the actual nitya dharma of all the jivas and uh, whatever uh, all the jivas what are there in oh, in this infinity material universe what we are finding that uh, what they are actually going away for those things the jivas that they are actually for that particular objects and persons individuals they are running for that particular enjoyment to get some enjoyment they are actually just getting into the cycle of birth and death you definitely going to be in that all the jivas infinity jivas those persons who are actually just running away for particular individuals and objects definitely they going to be going into the repetitive uh, cycle of birth and death
that asad vastu that which is temporary which is anitya that which don't have any eternal uh, existence is there which is not at all permanent that is asad it means that uh, maya is nirvid that is atad vastu inert and asad vastu that kind of sad buddhi that uh, that temporary object we are having permanent uh, thinking that is a uh, totally wrong conception where actually there is no kind of uh, anand no happiness is there there actually we are thinking that there is happiness definitely some kind of happiness is there and we are just running for that happiness it's one kind of my rage it is one kind of my rage it's one kind of my rage what we are actually running for it is all my rage everything is my rage everything is useless that in this material world it's just like a desert it is just in this desert like uh, we are thinking that there is water in the desert but actually there is no water at all in the same way that uh, that anand or happiness what kind of things which we want to get in this material life that what kind of things that the jivas are going here and there to just take that then that there is no kind of anand at all there is no kind of actual happiness there what the divas are running for it is just temporary happiness so asad vastu that asad vastu that kind of permanent sad 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 buddhi that you are having that intelligence towards that that kind of happiness you are getting in in return you are getting uh, sadness and disappointment that each and every person individual is getting this kind of thing in their life but this human being human birth but when some individual he is becoming actually intelligent in his own life but when some actual person is becoming an actual intelligent in his in his life then he can understand and again and again he is just getting down and down and down that under the guidance of pure guru vishnu he is getting the topmost association after that he can understand that what is actual thing that he becomes so much clever and intelligent that a prakrit intelligence comes and by getting the association of a pure guru vaishnav slowly steadily he is becoming top most intelligent that he is actually getting out of the concept of material happiness and enjoyment he is just getting out of that material happiness and sadness he is actually getting away from that and amrito avay ashok avay amrito jomaro charan doy tab kitan mein the in the kirtan bhakti no thakur already writ, writing about this what very nice kirtan bhakti no thakur has written very nice kirtan bhakti no thakur writing this actually just written in the books only in our life practical life this kind of kirtan we haven't actually tested in our own life just in the just in the books it is written that's it just in the books it is just written there and in our own practical life we haven't seen that at all we haven't just tested the, this in our practical life at all this is the actual condition what to do when the person individual becoming actually intelligent jiska bare mein bhagwan the thing of bhagwan shri krishna actually speaking to uddhav ji maharaj about this and he speaking to uddhav ji maharaj to uddhav ji maharaj actually questioning bhagwan shri krishna that bhagwan who is actually intelligent that each and every individual person is thinking that i am very much intelligent and uh, i am very much intelligent but every each and every person is thinking like that no person is actually thinking that i am foolish number 
एवरी पर्सन इज थिंकिंग दैट आई एम वेरी मच इंटेलिजेंट एवरी पर्सन इज थिंकिंग लाइक दैट भक्ति विनोद ठाकुर एक्चुअली स्पीकिंग येस दे आर इंटेलिजेंट दे आर क्लेवर येस बट अकॉर्डिंग टू देअर ओन एस्टिमेशन दे आर एक्चुअली क्लेवर भक्ति विनोद ठाकुर स्पीकिंग येस दे आर एक्चुअली क्लेवर डेफिनेटली दे आर क्लेवर बट दे आर थिंकिंग दैट दे आर वेरी मच इंटेलिजेंट येस दे आर बट अकॉर्डिंग टू देयर ओन एस्टिमेशन लिमिटेड एस्टिमेशन दैट ही इज एक्चुअली क्लेवर नॉट अकॉर्डिंग टू द एस्टिमेशन ऑफ भगवान और एंड गुरु वैष्णव ही इज नॉट एट ऑल इंटेलिजेंट अकॉर्डिंग टू दैम भगवान गुरु वैष्णव दे आर थिंकिंग दे आर नॉट एट ऑल दे आर एक्चुअली फुलिश नंबर वन अकॉर्डिंग टू देयर एस्टिमेशन भगवान एक्चुअली इन श्रीमद भागवतम ऑलरेडी टोल्ड उद्धव जी महाराज जवाब देश उद्धव जी महाराज आस्किंग दैट हु इज एक्चुअली इंटेलिजेंट प्रभु दैट यू सी कृष्ण स्पीकिंग दैट ईच एंड एवरी पर्सन इज थिंकिंग दैट ही इज वेरी मच इंटेलिजेंट ही इज वेरी मच क्लेवर बट ही एक्चुअली इज नॉट एट ऑल दैट पर्सन हु इज द टॉप मोस्ट इंटेलिजेंट ऑफ ऑल द इंटेलिजेंट पर्सन दैट ऑल दोज मनीषीज दैट इन ऑल द मनीषीज ही इज द टॉप मोस्ट महिषी इन दैम दोज हु नोज that this two days world just by getting this life for two days he, that he is actually thinking of the topmost amrit transcendental ras he is actually thinking of that that how we can get that transcendental rasa in our life that he can just get out of the repetitive cycle of birth and that how we can get out of that when this body is actually just of 2 days this body is just for 2 days we are having this body material body which very temporary this is anitya but still it is uh, meaningful it is temporary but it is meaningful in bhagavad gita mahapurana it is written it is anitya temporary but it is meaningful it is temporary but this is full of meaning it has some meaning but what does it have, what is the actual meaning of our life this the, it can give that amrit vilas it can give that guru Var, vaishnav can give us to amrit vilas and we can get the transcendental rasa by the help of pure guru vaishnav that's why bhagwan actually speaking to uddhav ji maharaj ji manisha ja manishina ja satyam anrite neha martena apne te that this um, material body just of 2 days just by taking that we are actually have want we can just become to uh, that much uh, eligible to get that uh, transcendental rasa we can't get that but we definitely gonna uh, taste the transcendental rasa by this material body bhagwan speaking that he is actually intelligent he is the top most intelligent who can understand that this two days life is just uh, can get out of the repetitive cycle of birth and death he can get the association of pure guru vaishnav and he can just get the bhagavat amrit all the time he should taste the transcendental ras and he can just get place in this uh, uh, per- permanent transcendental world and he can get out of this uh, repetitive cycle of birth and death so that's why prabhupada actually speaking that this human in body when the individual is becoming actually intelligent in actual sense when he just by getting uh, uh, disappointed day by day just by just kicking when he is getting kicked again and again by maya devi and he is just getting out of that uh, by by maya devi just by the kick of maya devi then only he can by the association of pure guru vaishnav that he can just get uh, arranged himself in the service of bhagwan and he can give everything for the bhag- service of uh, guru vaishnav and bhagwan all his life he can just get surrender onto the lotus feet of bhagwan guru and vaishnav the kirtan which i have already told you riga of bhakti vinod thakur amritu aadhar tumaro charana doy tate ekon bisram lohiya charinu bhavero hoy shishi radha guru shishi radha govind seva means gorang mahaprabhu seva when we can do that under the guidance of pure guru vaishnav then only we can get the actual intelligent and our shri shri radha govind did that because the actual minute vigraha of radha govind unification of radha and govind who is govind and who is radha rani 
the unification of both is actually Gaurang, Gaurang Vigraha. Shri Radha Govinda Milita Vigraha. That Shri Gaur Sundar, unification, Vigraha of Radha and Govinda, Gaur Sundar. That is the Seva Shri. That Seva Shri, that the kind of Seva Anand which we are getting, that the actual beautifulness of that Seva Vigraha. You haven't understand what I'm speaking. Now you tell me that what is the why actually we are uh, uh, putting shri in in the front of uh, uh, vaishnav's names like sometimes we are speaking infinity shri 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 like that or sometimes two times we are actually using shri shri in front of vaishnav name why because he the vaishnav is infinity uh, shri he has he has infinity shri shila rup goswami pad shila sanatan goswami pad shila bhakti vinod thakur Everyone is like Ananta Shri, Infinity Shri, because the their actual beautifulness of their Seva Bhav, the actual beautiful Bhav of their uh, Seva, that is uh, equivalent to, it is actually decorated with Ananta Shri, Infinity Shri. His life is decorated with Infinity Shri. His life means that his Seva, his uh, Seva mood, his Seva life is actually decorated with Infinity, uh, Infinity Shri it is actually decorated with that that's why we are using this uh, shri uh, for vaishnava's name so shri shri radha govind the unified unified form shri gaur sundar for each and every person he is giving this kind of seva and this seva anand he is giving he is all the time actually all the time busy in giving this uh, seva mood to each and every person in and coming uh, in this material world and that bhagwan that bhagwan and bhagwan's name is non different and that's why that just by taking the shelter of bhagwat bhagwat naam just by taking the shelter of bhagwat naam that we can can get the nitya transcendental seva of bhagwan and get the transcendental seva of bhagwan that nitya seva of bhagwan we can get in our life definitely we gonna get that of the, of this there is no doubt about it there is actually no other uh, question regarding that definitely you get we will get that the shlok which i have already started with that it is that it is from brahma samhita only that is the same Brahm Samhita Slok which uh, definitely I am going to discuss it later. Maybe when I will be going uh, later in the book uh, discussing that, I will be discussing that with you. The same Shloka which I have already uh, told you in the starting. And after that, and after that, and uh, maybe when I will be just going. Uh, later in the book discussing that i'll be just discussing that same shloka which i have already told maybe i have already spoken this shloka that devi dham where it is where that whole world this whole world which we are seeing is there devi dham that whatever we are seeing, it is all Devi Dham. Each and every object we are seeing, that everything is Devi Dham, what we are seeing here. So, that this Devi Dham, above that, there is Mahesh Dham. There is Mahesh Dham. Who is Mahesh? That that Sadashiv Mahesh Dham. That when you will be going after Brahma Jyoti, when you will be going uh, after Brahma Jyoti, which already written in Brahma Samhita, that after getting above Brahma Samhita, uh, Brahma Jyoti, you will be getting into Sadashiv Lok, and Sadhu Sadashiv Lok is not different from Vaikunth Lok, and ab- apart from Vaikunth Lok, above Vaikunth Lok there is uh, Golok. You understand what I'm speaking? This is actually Devidam where we are actually staying. Each and everything is Devidam. So, that above Devidam there is Mahesh Dham, and above Mahesh Dham is actually Vakunt Dham. 
देर इज एक्चुअली वैकुंठ धाम एंड अबव दैट इज गोलोक धाम so this kind of arrangement what we are getting this actually the top most transcendental eternal arrangement of bhagwan for us this is not at all temporary at all this is the eternal arrangement of bhagwan bhagwan has just arranged these kind of things for us now pichhle saptah that previous week which we were actually discussing that i have just started in the beginning at the beginning of brahm samhita i have already promised you that i have already promised you that the beginning of shri brahm samhita i have already promised you that that each and every vishay i will be discussing with in front of you each and every single vishay that krishna is upasya vastu and krishna is the only worshipable object shri krishna is the only worshipable object for this each and every individual i have already given this proof regarding that also after that bhagwan shri krishna is the actual upasya vastu and bhagwan shri krishna is the upasya vastu kisi ka and kisi ka zindagi in the life of no one in the life of no one if this kind of situation is coming that he actually apart from leaving govind he can't he he want to do the bhajan of other demigod if someone in some life of an individual or devotee we can find that then definitely his life will be going towards destruction if we actually just uh, uh, loving shankar bhagwan and what is our vichar regarding that that bhagwan is parat par akhileshwar that and that bhagwan shankar actually is not different from bhagwan he is achintya bheda by achintya bheda ve tat he is actually not different from bhagwan the only possible object is bhagwan sri krishna aur kuch nahi and nothing else kisi ka bhajan if some bhajan actually we are not at all doing of any demigod and only bhagwat bhajan we are doing that is more than enough this is more than enough to do that why because bhagwan inside bhagwans that infinity brahmand are there inside bhagwan that uh, just by doing the bhajan of bhagwan and just to do seva of bhagwan is actually everything is complete in that it is topmost complete package it means that paripurna topmost complete it is because bhagwan just to do aradhana and worship of bhagwan that in infinity brahmand each and every object we are actually worshiping all every uh, if we are actually worshiping bhagwan if if uh, we don't need to do bhajan of any of the demigods why because inside bhagwan each and everything is there all the time present eternally the thing which i have already uh, told you before regarding this that shri narad ji maharaj actually speaking that from bhagwat ji mahapurana it is written there लाइक यू कैन सी अ ट्री दैट देर इज वन ट्री एंड देर जस्ट बाई गिविंग वॉटर ऑन टू द रूट ऑफ द ट्री दैट होल नर्शिमेंट ऑफ द ट्री यू कैन गेट दैट ऑल नर्शिमेंट द ट्री इज गेटिंग सेपरेटली यू डोंट नीड टू गिव वॉटर टू ईच एंड एवरी ब्रांच दैट भगवान इन गीता ऑल्सो इट इज ऑलरेडी रिटर्न Rahura bayam ittadi sab baat etc all these things are already there in gita also that uh, in the 11th chapter of gita you can find the shlokas of bhagwan speaking there that openly bhagwan has already speaking everything regarding this yatha tararamol lisechanena tippanti taskandu bhujop sakha prano bharasya yathindriyanam tathiva sarva arhananam achyutejya 
that achhut is actually is a bengali word and in sanskrit also we are speaking achhut in hindi also we are speaking achhut but achhut word what do you mean is meaning who is never displaced from his own position that is actual meaning of achhut 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 katha means who is never displaced from his own position that is actual meaning of achhut who is not at all actually disbalanced from his actual position is not at all becoming unstable at all who is actually all the time glorifying that situation that is achhut all 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 actually all the time is glorified achhut he is actually if he is worshiping achhut then definitely it is called bhavanudrum भगवान का चरण का आराधना जस्ट बाई जस्ट बाई एक् वर्षिंग लोटस फीट ऑफ भगवान एवरी आराधना वर्षिपिंग ऑफ अदर डेमी गॉड इज ऑल ऑटोमेटिकली डन इफ समन एक्चुअली वर्षिपिंग लोटस फीट ऑफ भगवान देन इन्फिनिटी आराधना ऑफ ऑल द वर्शिप ऑफ ऑल डेमी गॉड्स इट ऑलरेडी प्रेजेंट इन दैट सेपरेटली आई डोंट नीड टू डू द एक्चुअल वर्शिप ऑफ अदर्स इट इज नॉट एट ऑल नेसेसरी टू डू एट ऑल इफ आई एम डूइंग द वर्शिप ऑफ भगवान आराधना ऑफ भगवान If uh, did separately we don't need to do the आराधना of some person at all. But if someone actually speaking, that why actually in हरी भक्ति विलास if actually someone actually questioning me that Maharaj that if uh, by भगवत भजन everything will be done, then why in श्री भक्ति हरी भक्ति विलास and uh, in चैतन्य चरितमृत in चैतन्य भागवत I will just open and show you that भगवान That Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, Bhagwan Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu speaking. That who is not at all loving Shankar, who is not at all loving Shankar at all, who is not at all worshiping uh, Shankar, then who, why he will do my puja? It's already written there in chapter, shlok number, everything. It, it's written there. I will tell you that why he will be worshiping me then. That who is not at all loving Shankar and worshiping Shankar. That Advaita Gosai, with Advaita Gosai, Mahaprabhu. has done this leela with advait gosain as well on whom there is a slight creep on you definitely he is my all my eternal parshad they are all my eternal parshad those who are actually worshiping me and he is not uh, worshiping shiva then definitely everything is useless for him in his life whatever he is doing nothing is there for him at all in his life nothing can happen in his life so that's why krishna is upasya vastu that is a worshipable object and after that that uh, from second to fifth shlok up till that that about the glorification of krishna dham and uh, the actual nirupan nirupan means that gokuldham nirupan nirupan means that gokuldham that in inside golok dham that topmost golok tatva you can uh, realize that tatva That Golok Dham, that about the actual tattva of Golok Dham, it is very much important to realize. Previously, that previous uh, week, that that from the last two to three days, we are actually discussing the same topic regarding that. That from the last two to three weeks, that two to three four days, we are actually all the time discussing this thing only. That. उटेंड वाय because each and every person that he is actually getting drowned in the material ocean every person doesn't mean that there is no vaishnava are not coming in that category may most of the persons they are actually just uh, contaminated with material matter and in this material matter they are all the time just uh, getting jumped into that material ocean it is quite natural for them to get into that and uh, this uh, thing i have already talked with you a lot of time that uh, the that there is no difference between gokul and golok this kind of difference you should understand but definitely some difference is there why it is not there that golok dham we cannot see golok dham where it is actually that golok dham 
एंड गोकुल आल्सो इट इज आवर इन वृंदावन धाम एंड वी आर एक्चुअली गोइंग टू वृंदावन धाम दैट वी आर जस्ट गोइंग टू दिस मटेरियल वर्ल्ड दैट इज कॉल्ड गोकुल मे बी दिस गोकुल एंड गोलोक देर इज नॉट एट ऑल एनी डिफरेंस देर इज नॉट एट ऑल एनी डिफरेंस बट स्टिल देर इज सम डिफरेंस हाउ इट इज हाउ डिफरेंस इज देयर दैट दिस काइंड ऑफ डिफरेंस दैट दिस इज नॉट वस्तुगत भेद दैट दिस इज द एक्चुअल भेद ऑफ अवर दर्शन यू हैव एन अंडरस्टैंड वट आई एम स्पीकिंग दैट वस्तुगत दैट फॉर अ पर्टिकुलर ऑब्जेक्ट लाइक गोलोक और एंड इन गोकुल दैट क्वालिटेटिवली देर इज नो काइंड ऑफ मंत्र एट ऑल that who which is gokul that is only golok that which is golok that is gokul but still there is difference what is that actual difference that our darshan there is some kind of difference in that that in our darshan there is some kind of difference that some kind of difference and non difference in our darshan is already there inside our darshan how this kind one example i'll be giving regarding this to you like in the sky there are lot of clouds in the sky like the case i have already told that in the sky there is lot of uh, clouds in the sky and uh, sun god and we cannot see the sun god at all with our naked eyes it doesn't mean that uh, the in the on the sky that clouds have just uh, uh, just covered up the sun it is not at all possible for them to cover it is impossible practically and scientifically why because this uh, earth this earth's volume is 14 times less than the sun's volume then the not 14 times sorry it is uh, sun's uh, volume is so much lakh times uh, more volume than earth you, if you will understand if you will do the vichar then you will just become mad because you have that material conception you will be blind because this one one uh, one uh, how it is possible for one part of cloud it can just uh, cover the sun it is not at all possible so what is the reason that uh, the reason is that our eye darshan that our material darshan is not at all uh, possible that it can see the actual reality that this kind of darshan it can just get uh, the be covered like by the clouds but for clouds it is impossible to cover the sun so in the same manner there is gokul and golok there is not a kind of difference in between the but still the in this material world whether you are in this material world he can uh, he can see in gokul a lot of things that material things he can see in gokul maybe these material things are not at all manifested in gokul at all like bhakti mohan thakur actually speaking that uh, on gaur dham there is some kind of network that on gaur dham there is uh, there is one kind of uh, netting of maya devi on gaur dham there is one kind of network or netting of maya devi and all these restaurants hotels all these foolish things are going on in that network only nobody can uh, touch that transcendental land at all that uh, those were paravans guru vishnu the top most pure that their heart is very much nirmal nirmal they can just get uh, stay in the dham all the time maybe the other outsider person he just staying in the dham also in vindavan dham the navadeep dham what kind of uh, he is actually just getting the contaminated with matter we can see that automatically you want to didn't understand what i'm speaking that uh, with matter it looks like it is contaminated with matter so there is actually this is not the fault of dham this is the actual fault of my eyes the darshan that gor kishor das baba ji maharaj this jo hamara navadip our navadip dham jo nitya viraj that which is all the time permanent in golok and this our uh, just by doing kripa navadip dham has just invented on this material world gor kishor das baba ji maharaj inside navadvip while he is staying there he is actually getting the golok darshan all the time but still we don't we are not at all getting golok darshan why because our darshan has some kind of fault definitely maybe uh, all individuals uh, elephants horse in vrindavan parikrama lot of people are there so much people actually doing vrindavan running like mad in all the four directions and all actually car going on lot of loud noise is there but still it is all 
दिस गोलोक धाम वट इट इज दे आर प्रेजेंट इटरनली दिस गोलोक धाम विच इज प्रेजेंट इटरली इन दैट देर इज नो काइंड ऑफ कैट्स एलिफेंट्स नथिंग इज देयर बट इन गोलोक वेन इट इज जस्ट टेकिंग द वर्ड ऑफ वैकुंठ एंड इज जस्ट गेटिंग मैनिफेस्टेड ऑन दिस वर्ल्ड देन डेफिनेटली इट इज लुक्स लाइक दैट इट इज कंटेमिनेट विद मटीरियल थिंग्स एक्चुअली माई कंसेप्शन इज एक्चुअली कंटेमिनेटेड माई दर्शन इज कंटेमिनेटेड बट दैट धाम इज नॉट एट ऑल कंटेमिनेट सो दैट सेम धाम जस्ट बाई सींग द विद आर अवर आईज दैट धाम यू अंडरस्टैंड वट आई एम स्पीकिंग दैट सेम धाम इज देयर बट स्टिल ओनली यू जस्ट नीड टू सी विद योर ट्रांसडेंटल आईज दैट धाम दैट इट मीन्स दैट यू हैव टू गो आउट ऑफ द रेंज ऑफ माया देवी माया दर्शन एंड देन ओनली बाई प्योर गुरु वैष्ण ऑफ ट्रांसडेंटल आईज यू कैन हैव दैट ट्रांसडेंटल दर्शन ऑफ भगवान दैट दिस गोलोक धाम एंड गोकुल धाम इट इज ऑल द टाइम इटरनली प्रेजेंट दिस इज नॉट एट ऑल सम टेम्पररी मटीरियल ऑपिलेंसिस इट इज नॉट इक्वल एंड टू दैट दैट इट इज क्रिएटेड ऑन दिस इट्स नॉट लाइक दैट देर इज दिस इज नॉट एट ऑल एप्लीकेबल बिकॉज दिस इज परमानेंटली प्रेजेंट दैट गोलोक एंड गोकुल दिस काइंड ऑफ ऑपिलेंसिस इट इज नॉट एट ऑल क्रिएटेड एट ऑल This is actually not a question of prakriti at all. Ananto dharmai Krishna ka oishi shakti. Hmm? Bhagwan ka ichha shakti. That this is a Bhagwan ichha shakti. That the infinity time you will be just just stay, uh, getting into this uh, thing of bhakti. भगवान श्री कृष्ण दैट काइंड ऑफ विलास भावना दैट भगवान श्री कृष्ण भगवान विलास भावना दैट बलदेव जी महाराज इज ही इज द एक्चुअल सोर्स ऑफ ऑल द शक्ति एंड इन आवर चंडी पाठ ऑल्सो वी हैव एक्चुअली सीन दिस ऑल्सो माया देवी दिस एक्चुअली वॉट वी आर स्पीकिंग नो दिस श्लोका दिस आधार भूता दैट आधार भूता शक्ति बट दिस इज एक्चुअल शक्ति ऑफ बलदेव एंड डेली इफ एक्चुअली इज गेटिंग द क्रिप ऑफ माया देवी देन दिस इज एक्चुअल नेगेटिव शक्ति ऑफ माया देवी दिस इज जस्ट अ शेडो ऑफ द एक्चुअल शक्ति अलादनी शक्ति माया देवी माया शक्ति दैट बलदेव हैज दैट इन्फिनिटी भाव ऑफ अनंत देव दैट काइंड ऑफ इन्फिनिटी भाव विच कैन सी इन बलदेव जी महाराज That kind of अनंत that is not अनंत that like Kunti Devi also by knowing she is we are actually speaking from Kunti the word कौनते in the similar manner in the similar manner what actually it's written that बलदेव स्वरूप that बलदेव जी महाराज this kind of अनंत भाव it is of two types actually one is चिदानंद and one is जोड़ानंद That Anand is definitely it is Anand is there. Chidanand and Jadanand definitely will be there. What does it mean actually? Baldev Ji Maharaj, actually this kind of bhav what they Baldav Ji Maharaj is is actually Chid Anand bhav. There is actually Chid Anand and Chad Anand, and this Chad material Anand. This is also this all stars planets what we are seeing. and that sun vivas for everything what we are seeing it is actually coming in chad anant this is chad anant and this chad anant that is also infinity but the actual very surprising and amazing thing to see that is this chad anant is is just one part of of the core part of brahm samhita this is just one part of brahm samhita and chid vibhuti chid anand chid dham You have an understand what I am speaking. So this uh, one path vibhuti, what you are see, that Bhagwan's one path vibhuti. This is actually Chidananda. That uh, Bhagwan has three path vibhuti. That is Chidananda. That is Chidananda. One path, only one path. One path means that roop having Chidananda vibhuti, and after some time. 
that brahm samhita just by and uh, reading that we can come on to this point slowly steadily lot of things uh, definitely it will come in uh, your session like the case about uh, devi devi maya in brahm samhita it is written this city bole sadana shakti re ka chhayeva jasso bhavana nivart durga ichcha rupa muti जोशुचा चेष्टति सा गोविंदमाली पुरुषम तमहम बजामी क्या बताया स्टोरी सृष्टि स्थिति पोले साधन शक्ति रेखा छाये व जस्सो हो बनाने विवर्ति दुर्गा इच्छान रूपम भी जस्सो जोशुचा चेष्टति सा गोविंदमाली पुरुषम तमहम तो मात्रो सो ओनली मात्रो एक ओनली वन टाइम There is only one time. एक पाद रूप. That one one पाद स्वरूप. Only one part. That Bhagwan. That there are four four path vibhuti. Out of that there is one part that is Jad Anand. That is material Anand. and that chidanand and chid anand that is the that is the topmost nectar of bhagwan that is three path vibhuti and this is jyotirmay and that chinmay vibhuti that uh, all stars comets sun moon everything it is not at all applicable in bhagwan's dham what they will do in the bhagwan's dham they are actually of this material world only this uh, sun comets sun god moon everything is of this material world only that bhagwan dham in the upanishad it is written that that for arasmi se that by the light by the rays of that by the actual effulgence of that uh, bhagwan by the actual brahm brahman effulgence of that bhagwan by the effect of that effulgence of bhagwan that all those sun god that bhagwan sun is actually getting his power his light he is getting a fulgence from that bhagwan only from that same topmost source bhagwan only that bhagwan jis bhagwan for that bhagwan by the effect of that bhagwan jis bhagwan by the effect of that bhagwan jis bhagwan ka prabhav by the effect of that bhagwan jis bhagwan ka tez se by the effect of the effulgence of that bhagwan bhagwan uh, sun god is getting the actual uh, effulgence and effect of that effulgence that is uh, is becoming more and more brighter just by the actual power of bhagwan bhagwan ka dham that bhagwan's dham bhagwan's na- bhagwan's dham and sun and moon god it is not at all uh, getting uh, uh, affected by the uh, by sun and moon god at all you can understand what i'm speaking that sun and moon god don't have this kind of uh, adacity that sun and moon god they don't have this kind of audacity that they can just uh, can uh, just uh, brighten up the dham of bhagwan they don't have this kind of audacity and capability to do that that the topmost effulgence of bhagwan what the effulgence bodily effulgence of bhagwan that kind of topmost if bodily effulgence by that bodily effulgence it is just a partial expression we can see in the sun god and moon god that in sun god what we are seeing that is just a partial expression of the bodily effulgence of bhagwan it is just manifested in front of us like that by that effulgence that of sun god is getting more and more effulgent he is getting that effect of light and is becoming more brighter just by the uh, effect of uh, bhagwan's bodily effulgence bhagwan that dham of bhagwan that nitya dham of bhagwan here if we are actually uh, understanding then what they will do sun sun and moon god what they will do in the dham of bhagwan ha sayati surjo no 
शशाको नो पावक यदगत्वा नाम परम गीता में इन गीता बताया इट्स ऑलरेडी रिटर्न रिगार्डिंग दिस व्हाट इट इज रिटर्न भाषयते सूर्यो नो शशाको नो पावक यदगत्वा नो निवर्तन्ते तत्याम परम मम सूरज चंद अग्नि विद्युत that bhagwan actually speaking to arjun that this all sun that my dham it is decorated it is not at all decorated by sun moon arjun you just understand this point very carefully arjun you understand this point very carefully that this sun moon and this agni and vidyut all this this will not at all decorate my dham at all they don't have this kind of capability to do that to decorate my dham my by my actual effulgence from coming from the body sun god is actually getting his brightness by the actual effulgence of my body the moon god is actually getting brightness and is getting the actual brightness sun god and moon god both and and we are actually that place we are going and where there is no no chance of getting uh, coming back from that place jahan jaane ka where after getting there it is not at all possible that you can come back from that place if some person so no person wants that he should go to golok dham vrindavan no one has this kind of desire that they should go to golok vrindavan dham that they should go to the vaikunth dham everyone actually is there in this material world like mayavadi they are enjoying this material world that's it nobody wants to go to golok dham how they will uh, want to go to golok dham you tell me you tell me how they will go the first that for the particular object you are getting that desire to go of that you can understand the utility of that particular object no but he is not at all understanding that at all they don't understand the utility of that particular object which they desire of dham of bhagwan dham naam they are actually all fraudster or cheaters they are cheaters they have taken the diksha from cheater and they themselves have become cheater and it's the case like the gurudev is okay but the disciple is not good this case can also be the same it can also be like that that nobody wants bhagwan that no that nobody wants bhagwan they want from bhagwan they don't want any they don't want bhagwan they want from bhagwan that's the thing so these people are thinking that uh, just by just cheating all the pure guru vaishnav they will be thinking that they are cheating themselves only they are thinking that they will be cheating uh, pure guru vaishnav only are you how you can cheat pure guru vaishnav you are actually becoming number 1 uh, owl yourself you can't uh, cheat them at all you, what what you can take crores and millions of millions of books and you can just uh, cheating the cheating the books and just uh, reprinting it you can do anything whatever you want <laughs> what we can do you want to reprint our books so what i can do in that you can do all the cheating all cheating stuffs you can propensities you can do i will not be doing any kind of case okay you can do whatever you desire if i if you will be wanting the books from me i i must have given you from what value it uh, cost to me they are all foolish number 1 they have just came to do bhajan that i am the disciple of this paramhans they are they are just quoting that title <laughs> they haven't you haven't seen that who is your disciple who that you are actually just giving the actual introduction of that guru even you have not seen the stool and urine that are prakrit stool and urine you haven't seen that you the actual relationship of guru there it's a very far distant thing very far distant thing what to speak of that to no tad bhasayate suryo no shashanko no pavakah yad gatyan anivartante tadyam parama ye baat so this point अभी विचार आता 
Now this which are actually is coming that Golok Dham and Gokul there is no not at all any difference I have already told it a lot of time before that if some this kind of question is coming inside someone that Maharaj how is, is it possible that one path Swarup and he, that uh, material Anand Vibhuti that you have already told us that that Chidanand Vibhuti the transcendental Anand that Vibhuti that how actually it can come in one path Vibhuti it is not at all possible you have told that is that Chinmay Vastu and material Vastu is totally different yes definitely they are actually different there is difference between material and Chid Vastu all the time they are actually uh, different no mixing is there like a Raj Hans that it can just uh, mixing milk with water he can separate milk and water simultaneously what it will do he can just uh, separate the water and can take the ingredients of milk out of that and it can separate it out and just can take out the milk from water so it is only the capability of a Raj, Raj Hans he has that eligibility to do that only he has the capacity in the same manner in the same manner just like this our Paramahans Guru Vaishnav what they are maybe they are our Paramahans pure Guru Vaishnav, they are maybe they are in Vrindavan that on this material earth Vrindavan has just gone got onto this material earth that's Vrindavan by the Kripa that is a Kokul only but still that their darshan is like that that Paramahansa people Paramahans persons like Swan is actually just uh, taking out the water by uh, when he is just taking the milk out of the water and separating the water element out. So like this, our Paramahans Guru Vaishnava, what they can do? Maybe this they in Bhom Vrindavan, maybe they in Bhom Vrindavan, that in Gokul they are actually staying, but still, this, this is the actual kind of darshan that Gokul and Golok, there is no difference in that. <coughs> That's why Bhakti Manu Thakur actually speaking that one path Swarup that one path Swarup that one path Rup that Jadanand Vibhuti that Sthan Vishesh, it is very much important to discuss regarding that. It can be done by, by discussing that. That Chidanant, that Tripad Vibhuti, that Chinmay Vibhuti is already present in this material Vibhuti. That can be possible. And this same Vibhuti, and this same Vibhuti, that is Swarupmay opulent Bhav, it is that Mahavakunt is actually expressed. And that Parabrahma, that which is actually the actual agochar of the chada prakriti material prakriti they, it has no contact with this material prakriti at all no kind of actual discussion is there regarding this material prakriti this uh, material prakriti after getting out of that virja river after getting out of that virja river when we are getting that nitya brahma effulgence uh, jyoti effulgence when we are going after just uh, leaving virja river after getting out of Virja river, that Nitya Brahma Jyoti, Brahman effulgence, that similar Brahma effulgence, when you are getting into that, that surrounded, that which is actually covered up by that Brahman effulgence, that Brahma effulgence, that kind of uh, uh, effulgent of Brahman effulgence, that Jyoti, after penetrating that, then after that you can uh, see the actual Vaikuntha Jagat, that Sadashiv Dham, that Sadashiv Dham up, you will be going up, then you will be finding, after that you will be finding that Vaikuntha, that Sadashiv Dham is not different, that is also Vaikuntha Dham only. Vaikuntha Dham also have different, different kind of diversities, and in, after just penetrating out of that, that Golok Dham you can find there. About this I have already told, in Sanatan Goswami Pad, in Brahad Bhagavat Amritan, from that which I have already told, Jeev Goswami Pad, that in the Sandarma, in the Shatta Sandarma, already it is written, I have already told. And again, I am actually discussing this, and I don't have this kind of desire to discuss it again. 
and uh, now this Gokul what has come that Golok Dham in the form of Golok Gokul how actually it is come in this material uh, this is material world uh, yes it is material world definitely Gokul and Golok it is not different it is not at all any difference is there but still Bhagwan Shri Krishna that Achinta Shakti is there you have you have heard about this no you haven't that Bhagwan's Achintya Shakti Achintya means that that which is out of the range of your uh, thinking power from where for what range you are actually thinking you are actually thinking is going on that limited li- thinking material intellectual intellectuality up till what point you will be getting that it is more than that now you can just get uh, very much uh, amazed so that's why it is actually not different from gokul golok bhagwan shri krishna that by the achint shakti of bhagwan that this golok dham that is getting from this chit jagat and from that topmost mat with mathura mandal it's just getting uh, that in the form of gokul it is actually getting manifested here and this jad maya prasiddha that by this jad material maya that one pad vibhuti swarup that in this material world it is just getting manifested in this still heats chinmay by the achinta shakti of bhagwan it is possible that three path vibhuti of the transcendental world is getting into this one path vibhuti of this material world by this which are it is not at all possible this kind of thinking is not at all uh, getting that by achinta shakti only it is possible like in chaitanya jagdamrit bhagwan actually speaking what he has spoken how this how this is possible bhagwan actually speaking himself this point i am actually just getting in this material world in everywhere and this whole world is actually inside me and each and every fraction of uh, uh, this uh, room comp uh, of mahavishnu this whole material world is there how it is possible this point that i speaking that i am this in this material world and all this material world is in me and again is speaking that i am not in this material world and i am not at all in this material world <laughs> how it is possible this is achintya prabhav of achintya shakti yes tomorrow i will be actually discussing it from gita how it is possible for bhagwan yes it is possible because by the achintya shakti of bhagwan it is possible for bhagwan to do everything possible what is impossible that what chit dham this kokul how they are to with that three path vibhuti may chin may that achintya it is but still it is nikrist it is getting into this one path vibhuti swarup of this material world it can stay there in this material world bhakti no thakur actually speaking that can never be solved by any जीवात्मा जीवात्मा कोई इज एबल टू हुज एग्जिस्टेंस इज जस्ट लाइक व्हाट इट इज इनफाइटेसिमल एग्जिस्टेंस ऑफ दैट पर्टिकुलर जीवात्मा इट्स इज एग्जिस्टेंस इज इनफाइटेसिमल अ नॉर्मल वेरी स्मॉल इनफाइटेसिमल जीव बाय जस्ट टेकिंग द सपोर्ट ऑफ भुक्ति एंड मुक्ति ही जस्ट वॉन्ट्स टू गो अहेड and just by thinking by his intellectual thinking material thinking but that jeevatma can get a feedback and he can come back to his original position he'll just get a great feedback from maya devi and it will just fall down about this i have already told you know that the infinitesimal jiva this kind of very low consciousness they can't understand the actual aprakritatva of bhagwan that the achintya swarup of krishna and the achintya shakti by the effect of achintya shakti the introductory part of that a jiva can't understand at all that golok dham is transcendental and this same trunk uh, golok dham is just getting in the form of gokul is also uh, transcendental so what does it mean actually that this prapanchik material world that in this material world prapanchik material world that's by getting the just he is getting avirbhar but still this in this material world just by getting the manifestation of gokul dham 
in the form of gokul just getting manifestation here in this material world it is not at all touched by any material time space and matter that material time space and matter of this material world it is uh, and it is uh, the golok dham is unaffected by that it is not at all even touched by the material time factors it is untouched that param vaikuntha tattva in the form of that then it is all the time is there present in the vaikuntha uh, situation it is just for our own darshan that our uh, actual fault in our darshan that just by getting vrindavan darshan that or all bull stool urine rocks and just monkeys we are actually fine in vrindavan we are not at all finding actual vrindavan that's why in vrindavan that uh, by our own uh, self and by our own uh, by our own self if we are going to vrindavan and just by making uh, our own effects to stay in vrindavan it is just one kind of material effort to stay there we are actually prabhupad speaking that in order to, uh, we don't have any adhikar to stay in radhakund prabhupad himself speaking that we are not at all eligible okay we can just uh, speak lotus feet of the govardhan that you give me one nice small place and this radha kund prabhu is speaking just by his humble mood he is speaking that we can't stay in radha kund so all those bonded jeevas what to speak of them what to speak about them you tell me that that i will be going to vrindavan i'll be just taking very nice piece of land and there while be just doing bhajan kutir and i'll be doing bhajan there Are, what you will do there it's just one kind of lucky laughing stroke when vrindavan they have taken one piece of land and there i'll be doing bhajan okay you have to do bhajan let me see how you can do bhajan like that i have already told this golok dham go in the form of gokul that chinmay dham that in this material prapanchik jagat after getting manifested in this material world it is not at all touched by any time material time space and matter at all this material time space and matter by that it is unaffected it is not at all touched at all this vaikuntha tattva is not at all touched by material matter but still all those material materialistic infinitesimal small jeevas in the eye of those jeevas they are actually having all material darshan they having the material darshan vikoshiya hidnayon just by these eyes material eyes we cannot see vrindavan at all by these material eyes lot of kirtan are there regarding this that they don't have any kind of desire to do kirtan they don't know kirtan so what to do in that very nice nice kirtan are there dayal bajendo nanno no bhaje jai jan shabhalo jivano ta dayal bajendo nanno no bhaje jai jan shabhalo jivano ta very nice nice kirtan are there no one actually want to speak also no want to hear listen to this kirtan everyone actually doing maya kirtan all just just enjoy just enjoy yourself just eat drink and sleep this is the only formula for all the brahmachari and sanyasis full of material enjoyment they want that's it and how they can understand this point what is written in the kirtan previously for that particular object you have that greediness no then only you can understand so you have that greediness for gold and silver so you have greediness for gold and silver because you know the actual value what gold can do but what from bhagwan you don't know that's why you don't have any attraction for bhagwan are okay i have taken diksha okay right what to do 2000 years back i have taken diksha so okay you have taken if you have taken not taken it's all the same so what to do in that bhakti mundra thakur speaking that this prapanchik materialist materialistic jeevas infinitesimal their material darshan that material dharma that kind of avesh in order to break that 
दैट काइंड ऑफ अ वेस्ट ऑफ मटीरियल दर्शन दैट इन रिस्पेक्ट टू गोकुल रिलेशनशिप दिस काइंड ऑफ मटीरियल मटीरियलिस्टिक मटीरियलिस्टिक इंटेलेक्चुअल माइंड इज ऑल द टाइम देयर विद गोल ऑफ वृंदावन मे बी गोल ऑफ वृंदावन डोंट हैव एनी काइंड ऑफ मटीरियल कंटेमिनेशन दो हॉर्स नो होटल नो कार नथिंग नो रेस्टोरेंट नथिंग इज देयर ऑन इन देयर बट स्टिल वी आर एक्चुअली फाइंडिंग दैट बिकॉज वी हैव फॉल्ट ऑफ दैट मटीरियल दर्शन ऑल दोज बॉन्डेड जीवस आई गिव यू वन एग्जाम्पल रिगार्डिंग दिस वॉज भक्ति में ठाकुर एज गिवन दैट अकॉर्डिंग टू आवर ओन माइंड दैट काइंड ऑफ फॉल्ट इज देयर ऑफ दैट मटीरियल दर्शन अकॉर्डिंग टू दैट ओन मटीरियल दर्शन मटीरियल कॉन्कोटेड आइडियाज आर ऑल द टाइम बाई आवर मटीरियल सेंस ऑर्गन वी आर गेटिंग दैट दर्शन इन रिलेशनशिप विद गोकुल एंड दैट सेम काइंड ऑफ थिंकिंग इज कमिंग इन दैट ट्रांसडेंटल गोकुल तत्व एज वेल दैट काइंड ऑफ मटीरियल प्रतीति इज डेफिनेटली देयर इन रिलेशनशिप विद दैट गोकुल तत्व एज वेल बट बाई वेरी बट बाई द टॉप मोस्ट कृपा टॉप मोस्ट लक इन बाय द टॉप मोस्ट लक एंड द टॉप मोस्ट कृपा ऑफ प्योर गुरु वैष्णव दैट काइंड ऑफ मटीरियल दर्शन we can get out of that only by the grip of pure guru vishnu what actually gunarottam das thakur has done kirtan what kind of kirtan he has done hmm kya kirtan what kirtan gunarottam das thakur has done regarding this kobe nitai chader koruna hoy bishoy vasuna mor kobe tuchch hoy bishoy chhariya kobe shuddho hobe mon kore kobe ham herobo sibindavan You haven't uh, not remembering this kirtan. Lord Narottam Das Thakur has written this kirtan. Very nice kirtan. No things you want to uh, listen. Everything you have forgot. You no. I have. I am not at all remembering. I have just forgotten everything. Narottam Das Thakur has given this kirtan to us. Very nice kirtan. विषय छिया कवि शुद्ध हे मन कवि हम हे रब दिस इज द एक्चुअल कीर्तन ना ऑल द सेम वॉट भक्ति नो ठाकुर एक्चुअली स्पीकिंग वेन द माया दर्शन यू इज एक्चुअली एग्जॉस्टेड गोइंग वैंक्विस्ट ऑल ऑल माया दर्शन इज डिस्ट्रॉयड ऑल एक्चुअली अप्राकृत दर्शन यू आर हैविंग दैट बाय द एक्चुअल लक बाय टॉप मोस्ट लक भक्ति नो ठाकुर स्पीकिंग दैट वेरी टॉप मोस्ट लक इफ यू आर हैविंग what kind that kind of in their bhajan life this kind of uh, mike darshan that kind of mike darshan and sambandh in that completely absolutely destroyed and vanquished for that person only for that particular person only that to stay in gokul and to just see gokul and gokolok darshan it is all the same he can take that you understand what i'm speaking that to have darshan of gokul and golok and golok and gokul that kind of same darshan can like in gor kishor ashtakam it is written there regarding this kabhi pada nahi you haven't uh, read that kind of because you haven't seen that in gor kishor gor kishor ashtakam program bande gor kishor sangam gor paja bhed vishishta program That Gaurdham and Brajgam, they are actually non-different from each other. And Golok and Gokul, this kind of uh, non-different, that kind of uh, Gaur Kishor Das Baba Ji's uh, darshan is there. This already written there. just be careful on this point on this special point you just need to be very careful on this special attention should be given and on this wish i just want to catch your special attention uh, attention on this very vital important topic that that which are you just need to focus on that very carefully what is that that 
that for each and every person that their chintan and vichar that under the circumference area it is it is so much smaller that whatever you are speaking that they are speaking it under it is understood that their area of thinking is very small they can't understand material area of thinking is nothing at all but still by that their circumference and area is so much small that they can't even understand the actual difference between material and transcendental world and there are some persons like that also that they are from this material world only that that they have done, haven't done their they have just taken guru charan ashram they are just material haven't done their actual bhajan but now what happened to them that in bolpur that is very no, nice top most intelligent person was living who in the calcutta uh, university has done triple ma in there in calcutta university shila bhakti vallabh tirth ko swami mara always used to speak his name he is speaking that uh, so much intelligent materially intelligent that he is so much uh, intellectually conscious and i have also been going to bolpur there actually in shri chaitanya gaudiya mata i have done hari katha in down hall as well and i also also stayed that one to two days but uh, that eating and sleeping is already total different this kind of vichar for me and very important person i just forgot his name that kolkata university university used to speak him genius that person particular person what his name i actually forgot that his name in bolpur he is so much actually so much deep consciousness is there intellectual consciousness is there at that time there is actually at the british time horse cart was there that there is not cart this kind of horse cart is there and that car just came and in the car that there is actually that um, sarthi is there and uh, he is actually just getting into the uh, horse cart he is just getting inside the horse cart and he is speaking to that driver that horse chariot he just uh, get into that and that handle of the car he is just uh, taken that and he is actually seeing one tree and he is becoming stand still there for a lot of time he is not at all speaking anything and the actual driver speaking what happened prabhu okay okay let let's go and what's his name very important name i actually forgot his name all the time i used to speak his name uh, and he by see you see how he is thinking in this material consciousness world a lot of conscious people are there maybe their consciousness is not at all touching the golok consciousness but still it can go up till that point like the muslim poet muslim poet that nazrul islam rabindranath tagore these poets their consciousness has just gone on to that super krishna conscious state they can't do bhajan but still this kind of area of consciousness of einstein the circumference is very much broad and expanded that is so much expanded and broad that you can't even imagine that vyapak means that uh, it is just not like bhagwan but bhagwan is vyapak i can't speak this word vyapak also that i want to speak that they have a very kind of quite broad spectrum of view prajan shil i just uh, remember his name his name is prajan shil who in the calcutta university in the uh, actual history of calcutta university nobody wants uh, nobody can just uh, uh, remove his name that is prajan shil and there is another genius that bipin bihari who is actually from sadinda sangram he is also a genius and satej satej satejnath bosh he is a scientist they are all genius but they are actually material genius and in their life no one actually can beat them at all by their actual uh, uh, concocted ideas what they have done prajin shil has done bhajan or not i don't know and tirth maharaj also have spoken about this i never haven't seen bhajan shil as well tirth maharaj also haven't seen him physically maybe it's a very long time before yeah, out of british time only at the time of bhakti no thakur but he actually actually speaking that he has just passed one comment not going who has not gone through priti sandarbha his life is a, is useless but jinone for that person jinone 
दोज हुट कॉट हैवन अंडर गोन प्रीति संदर्भ हिज लाइफ इज टोटली फ्लॉप एंड यूजलेस लाइक द सिनेमा इज गेटिंग फ्लॉप नो लाइक अ कॉमेडी और सम फ्लॉप सिनेमा इज गेटिंग फ्लॉप इन द सेम मैन ऑफ भजन शील स्पीकिंग द सेम थिंग ही इज एक्चुअली थिंकिंग डेफिनेटली ही हैज डेफिनेटली हैव हर्ड एंड एंड ही हैज रेड शट संदर्भ एवरी थिंग ऑल संदर्भ प्रीति संदर्भ ही हैव रेड हाउ ही कैन स्पीक लाइक दैट he actually speaking that those who haven't uh, uh, read priti sandarv in their life their life is totally waste and flop stephen hawk stephen hawk from the stephen hawk very top most uh, conscious uh, people in this material world we can find stephen hawk lot of people are there einstein lot of big big uh, uh, philosophers are there pythagoras lot of people are there regarding that very heavily conscious people leonardo da vinci leonardo da vinci lot of big big people are there but we jo sant mahatma our pure guru vaishnav that in this indian soil that bharat bhumi that top most all those rishi munis what we are finding in this bharat bhumi no one actually has just came to just take uh, to came in front to came up from in them in front of them they have so much kind of topmost capability that in this whole material earth that all kind of mathematics gyan vigyan whatever you can find of the scientific procedures and which are you can find among the scientists it is all actually coming from our rishi muni sides only of this bharat varsh that all kind of uh, ayurvedic medicinal uh value and studies actually originally came from india only from bharat only from the chikitsa astronomy astrology gyan vigyan physics chemistry mathematics everything whatever actually has come all everything has come from this bharat bhumi it has just originated from there and we are actually just getting uh, in fr- front of them so much actually useless to think of all this and we should feel shy and shame so whatever the thing is i am the actual thing is that it is very much am- amazed and surprising to hear this point that jo mayavadi that those mayavadi people those who can thinking that i am the top most gyani that they are thinking themselves that i am top most gyani that they are actually gyani what kind of gyani they are they are actually mayavadi they are actually dry philosophers dry philosophers they are tad and atad are this is tad vastu are you just need to throw that this is not all tad vastu this is atad vastu this kind of vichar mayavadi is having you understand this point very carefully that what is the actual vichar of mayavadi this is tad and this is atad it means that this is tad vastu and this is atad vastu this is actually user you just need to throw that away this kind of conception is then means analytically that mayavadi mayavadi analytically that when he is getting up to that platform that in front of that that according to our uh, own vision they are actually very down that according to their own vichar they are getting up so above above mayavadi what is the actual reason the, how they can go up that this is atad you just need to throw that no no no, no. The, this is atad you just need to throw that that is tad vastu just need to take that no no no, no. this is actually okay this bhagwan is also atad this brahm is good okay bhagwan you just need to kick like uh, you have to do the seva of maya devi no no we don't that no bhagwan nitali no 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 we don't nitali la bhagwan not at all but all atad just need to kick that brahm is actually everything only they are speaking like that only brahm is everything bhagwan is nothing this vichar they are having that the according to the vichar of prabhupad that according to the vichar of prabhupad that mayavadi people that tad and atad by this kind of vichar is by slowly steadily doing this vichar slowly steadily that they are actually just kicking bhagwan also away you understand what i'm speaking that what kind of laughing stroke it is <laughs> that they are actually thinking of that tad and atad vastu but still they are actually kicking bhagwan away are bhagwan's body is also like material body only so this maya vadi this kind of glorification is so much that by just doing vichar tad atad tad atad this kind of vichar he is actually kicking away bhagwan also very nice you see lot of top most glorification there he is actually big tyagi ji maharaj he is actually throwing away bhagwan as well i have already seen in vrindavan mahatyagi ji maharaj 
वन जीरो जीरो एट महात्यागी जी महाराज वन जीरो एट आश्रम इज देयर आई एम एक्चुअली जस्ट लाफिंग एंड जस्ट इन गोवर्धन आई एक्चुअली हैव सीन दैट माय महात्यागी जी महाराज वन जीरो जीरो एट वन थाउजेंड एट त्यागी जी महाराज आश्रम इज देयर दैट व्हाई एक्चुअली स्पीकिंग वन थाउजेंड एट ही कैंट स्पीक दैट रीजन बिहाइंड दैट इट इज वन काइंड ऑफ कॉम्पिटिशन विद अस यू सी that according to the vedic upanishad that kind of vichar that kind the 108 name what is actually coming giri parbat all this sagar all actually is coming there no they are actually thinking that they are actually giving 100 so we will be giving 1008 we will give <laughs> so this one com- wow, how you are getting 1008 this kind of names how you are getting 1008 or maharaj 1008 is uh, they they are we are giving 108 so we are actually 1008 we are giving we are actually more uh, higher than them they are actually foolish number one just with the competitive mood they are doing everything they can't understand the actual thing so this uh, this atta uh, niroshan that uh, definitely you should have that uh, knowledge about language that vedant language atta then tad and atad vastu that kind of difference just by separating the tad vastu slowly steadily you are also i am actually going towards tad vastu this kind of vichar that you just need to separate the atad vastu and throw it away but this which his vichar is so much his vichar is so much actually dirty that he is actually separating and throwing bhagwan away also so bhakti no thakur speaking that this atad niroshan atad niroshan means that you just need to remove atad you understand you just need to remove that you just speaking they are just removing poverty <laughs> like this slogan they are using that foolish number 1 this atad niroshan swarup that atmaramata they are thinking that that you just need to separate atad vastu and you are getting into the brahma effulgence all the time and he is becoming atmaram this kind of foolish conception they are having what to do in that so this atad niroshan swarup atmaramata this is very much dangerous that atad niroshan swarup atmaramata that kind of uh, getting into that brahm effulgence is very much dangerous which can which can give you atmaramata this is not at all perfect atmaramata but still it is uh, there like the case of uh, the previously lot of uh, proofs are there regarding this that just by thinking of the some brahm some are actually thinking of omkar ek akshar brahm like our sukhdev goswami previously that nirgun brahm actually i used to do the bhajan of nirgun brahm and just by getting the actual quality and characteristics of bhagwan i am just feeling some attraction towards bhagwan slowly steadily so here that atad niroshan swarup that atad niroshan swarup slowly steadily those who are getting atmaramata this kind of uh, that kind of bhav actually is getting inside your heart that atad niroshan swarup that atmaramata janak that kind of gyan it cannot be it cannot be stable and that kind of sachidanand chin matra brahm it is don't have any kind of uh, language you don't know that you will be just uh, separating it away into pieces and and i'm just putting in front of you i want to speak in front of you that those who are actually just separating atand that they are actually going want to go above that brahma uh, tattva and he just wants to get away from this all this material darshan and material objects he has just made the arrangements what we call that is atmaramata that gyan with that knowledge is getting regarding that atmaramata inside his heart in that that sachidanand chin matra brahm that kind of anubhuti is definitely there you have not understand what i am speaking in that ultimately that chin matra that chin my anubhuti you can get after that that kind of chin my after that chin my you cannot uh, have that uh, understanding and realization it means that this uh, 
दे शीतल दैट लूजली अटैच्ड इट इज वेरी लूजली अटैच्ड दैट सचिदानंद चिन्ह मात्र दैट ब्रह्म रियलाइजेशन व्हाट यू आर गेटिंग इट इज जस्ट लाइक वेरी लूजली दैट वैकुंठ तत्व दर्शन दैट कैन नॉट यू कैन गेट एट ऑल बाय हैविंग द एक्चुअल रियलाइजेशन ऑफ दैट वेरी स्मॉल पार्ट ऑफ ब्रह्म रियलाइजेशन यू आर गेटिंग बाय दैट काइंड ऑफ थिंकिंग यू कैन नॉट एंटर इन टू दैट वैकुंठ जगत एट ऑल वैकुंठ जगत दर्शन इज वेरी वेरी फार अवे दैट काइंड ऑफ वैकुंठ तत्व दर्शन इज यू कैन नॉट गेट दैट एट ऑल टू रियलाइज दैट वैकुंठ तत्व एट ऑल वैकुंठ तत्व दर्शन हाउ यू कैन हैव द दर्शन इट इज एक्चुअली सो मच लो दिस ब्रह्म रियलाइजेशन दिस इज वेरी स्लाइट चिन्ह मात्र अनुभूति इज देयर दैट भगवान धाम नाम एक्चुअली इज नॉट एट ऑल अंडरस्टैंडिंग एंड रियलाइजिंग अबाउट दैट वॉट ही विल डू सो दैट आत्म जा आत्मा राम राम का जनक रियलाइजेशन एंड नॉलेज इट कैन नॉट गेव दैट एक्चुअल रियलाइजेशन ऑफ दैट वैकुंठ रियलाइजेशन इट इज वेरी मच फार फार अवे फ्रॉम दैट वैकुंठ तत्व दैट काइंड ऑफ रियलाइजेशन ऑफ वैकुंठ तत्व फॉर दैम इट इज नॉट एट ऑल पॉसिबल टू अंडरस्टैंड एंड रियलाइज दैट फॉर दोज पर्सन लाइक द केस आवर प्रबोधन सरस्वती पाद एक्चुअली स्पीकिंग वेरी विद अ वेरी डीप deep sad condolence he is speaking kya afsos what kind of uh, deep sadness he is feeling badano pari fullana joro motino brahma aham badano pari fullana joro moti ti joro moti this jada moti जड़मती मीन्स दैट मटीरियल कंसेप्शन इज देयर दैट बाय द ओन रियलाइजेशन ऑफ ज्ञान और बाय द एक्चुअल रियलाइजेशन ऑफ योगिक प्रैक्टिस और बाय द कार्मिक प्रैक्टिस बाय दोज काइंड ऑफ प्रैक्टिस ऑफ कर्म एनी हाउ यू कैन नॉट रूच अप टू द लेवल ऑफ वैकुंठ एट ऑल इट इज नॉट एट ऑल पॉसिबल वैकुंठ लेवल इट इज नॉट ऑल पॉसिबल टू गेट लाइक दैट इट इज नॉट एट ऑल पॉसिबल एट ऑल प्रबोधन सरस्वती पास भी जस्ट बी केयरफुल ऑन दिस पॉइंट वन एम स्पीकिंग मुक्ति पद भी तावत न तिक्ति भावे तावत चाप भी श्रृंखल लोक वेद स्थिति महाप्रभु वन डिवोटी वेन यू आर नॉट एट ऑल गेटिंग द दर्शन ऑफ दैट पर्टिकुलर डिवोटी ऑफ चैतन्य महाप्रभु when you are not at all getting the darshan of the eternal parshad of uh, premik bhakt of gorang mahaprabhu the top most premik bhakt of mahaprabhu you are not at all getting uh, association up till that point the fighting will go on are this is not at all good this you just need to reject this brahm is actually good this is good you are actually speaking wrong this kind of material obligations will go on all the time and when you are get, getting the actual a honey of the lotus feet of gorang mahaprabhu that association of devotee are getting that all kind of log- logical arguments and interventions will all that you will get destroyed and completely sare tark vitark all kind of logical interventions and arguments will just get uh, uh, destroyed because that kind of uh, the eternal parshad of gorang mahaprabhu you are getting association even a dog also if he is getting the actual uh, getting the association of devotees of gorang mahaprabhu still he will also get delivered aaj ho sake like maybe i'll be just telling you in the night time about this in the hari katha very actually topmost vichar it is karma kandi vyakti karma kandu leke vyasto hai karma kandi people they are actually busy with the karma kandi they are busy with karma kand all the time and they want to go above that and those who are gyan kandi they are actually they want to go above that and the yogic people they according to their own standard and eligibility they want to go above but everything is useless up till that point when you are you are not at all dependent on the krip of bhagwan 
अप टिल दैट पॉइंट एवरी थिंग इज एक्चुअली यूजलेस एट एट दैट टाइम वैन प्योर गुरु वैष्णव भगवान धाम नाम एक्चुअली यू हैव फुल कॉन्फिडेंस ऑन दैट यू विल बी हैविंग दैट कॉन्शियसनेस दैन डेफिनेटली एवरी थिंग विल गेट सॉल्व बिफोर दैट इट इज नॉट एट ऑल पॉसिबल दैट द प्रॉब्लम विल गेट सॉल्व एट ऑल इट इज नॉट एट ऑल पॉसिबल बिफोर इट इज इम्पॉसिबल how they can they can understand the vaikuntha just not to see vaikuntha it is a far distant thing to see vaikuntha in order to understand it is difficult to understand the vaikuntha kriya sakta anudhik dekho jo hum bol rahe hain the thing which i am actually speaking prabodhan and also speaking the same thing bhakti no thakur also speaking the same thing kriya sakta anudhik dikkar diya they are just actually speaking spitting on that they are spitting on that which actually having full faith on karm kand that they are actually just throwing it away and just spitting it on it jigostu brahma ham badana pari pulnan joro motinu kim etamo sochamo bisharo samatyano joro noro poshuno na kathanchit aha ha militu gauro madhu gauro madhu up till today up till today up till today in his life there is mahaprabhu no he is not getting the glorification of the gorang mahaprabhu's lotus feet no no news they have on to the lotus feet of gorang mahaprabhu that they have taken sanyas they have taken sanyas vesh they have done brahmachari vesh but up till this point they have no news regarding mahaprabhu's lotus feet that's why they are actually just getting entangled in all these things if they got the actual news of the chaitanya charan glorification of gorang mahaprabhu maybe they can they will not be doing all this kind of rubbish stuff that those who are actually ugra tapasya they are actually all rubbish just have to spit on those karam kandi people and we'll be just speaking that they are speaking that they are speaking that i am brahm and they are laughing like ha ha having laughing stroke they are the number one demons who are speaking themselves that they are actually brahm they are actually speaking that we are actually become brahm oh so very nice they are actually also rubbish they have to throw them in the garbage digostu brahma aham badaram pari phullan joro matino kim etano sochamo bishara samatyano noro pasuno e noro pasu they are noro pasu they looks like human being but they are actually beast e noro pasu as tak bhi up till today also they have don't have any kind of god the lotus feet of chitanya mahaprabhu that they haven't got the glorification of the gorang mahaprabhu's lotus feet they don't know about that at all you see the case up till today also they don't know the actual glorification of the gorang mahaprabhu's lotus feet they don't know the actual glorification they don't have this kind of news any news regarding the glorification that's why all actually are getting into entangled into useless stuff useless garbage stuff so what to do in that what we can do in that we can't do anything for them only we can just shed some tears and pray for them we can just shed some tears we can't do anything else because they will not listen to it what to do bishara samatano noro pujano kotonjit oho ho milito gauru madhuno asa gauranga up till this they don't know the actual glorification of gorang mahaprabhu so what we can do in their life if they don't know the actual glorification of gorang mahaprabhu who knows the actual glorification of gorang mahaprabhu mahaprabhu he will just get mad just like ragunath das goswami he can throw everything of this material world away and he can just like a garbage he can throw and run towards the total lotus feet of gorang mahaprabhu to drink the topmost nectar and amrit the topmost honey like nectar what you are doing How? why you are wasting your time with all useless things jiska koi stability we do, which don't have any kind of stability in the life that you are actually running for that what you are doing actually why you are doing what is the actual purpose behind that very actually it's very sad to very it's very sad to hear and see these all things it is very much disappointing when what we have just taken in this material world with us and we are busy in something else 
ही डोंट हैव एनी न्यूज ऑफ गोरंग महाप्रभु लोटस फीट इन हिज लाइफ दैट नो नो अबाउट द एक्चुअल ग्लोरिफिकेशन ऑफ गोरंग महाप्रभु लोटस फीट ही कैन जस्ट बिकम मैड जस्ट लाइक रघुनाथ दास को स्वामी पाद ही कैन थ्रो ईच एंड एवरीथिंग अवे ईच एंड एवरीथिंग ही कैन थ्रो अवे लाइक अ गार्बेज एंड टुवर्ड्स दैट चरण कमल टू ड्रिंक अमृता मधु क्या कर रहे हो what you are actually doing how and why you are wasting your time with all useless things jiska koi stability nahi you don't have any kind of stability kya kar rahe what you are doing actually why you are doing what is actual reason behind it bara afsos but very it's very actually sad to hear all this very sad to hear all this bara afsos very sad to hear about all this what you have actually taken in this material world we are they are just living their life like that so so golok dham so golok dham vaikuntha ka khabar the vaikuntha news and golok news kisi ko pata nahi nobody chan. knows about that at all gyan chesta ke dwara that by the actual gyan chesta in order to understand the actual brahma knowledge that by karma chesta by yogic chesta different different kind Gyan of desires for gyan yog those who are following the trap knowledge dry knowledge they depend upon their own capacity they never depend upon bhagwan and guru vishnu so they are cheated they depend they like to purify their darshan by thinking thought and atat वेरी नाइस फाइन दर्शन अबाउट वेरी फाइन दर्शन तद एंड अत दिस काइंड ऑफ विचार वेन दे आर हैविंग दैट दैट जस्ट बाय हैविंग दिस काइंड ऑफ विचार ऑफ तद वस्तु एंड दे जस्ट नीड टू थ्रो द अत वस्तु एंड जस्ट बाय हैविंग दिस काइंड ऑफ फाइन विचार दैट दे आर एक्चुअली जस्ट वॉर अ प्राकृत तत्व दे आर एक्चुअली जस्ट रनिंग फॉर दैट इट इज जस्ट लाइक अ मैड थिंग This is just kind of another mad thing. Why? Because it is not at all possible like that. This kind of distinction is just kind of a mad, mad case. That's it. In our Bhagwat Ji Mahapuran also, it is already written there that oh Maya Vadis, oh Tatha Kathi Maya Vadis, oh so called Maya Vadis, you just hear it. that just by taking the wish of all the devotees in front of others yeah externally you are actually just like devotees but inside you are actually mayavadi and you are actually more dangerous than mayavadi why because mayavadi at least they are not at all coming to fight in front of us but they are actually just uh, uh, aprakrit which are they are destroying the uh, uh, aprakrit which are of vaishnav they are actually all destroying the vaishnav sampraday after getting death where they will go for infinity period we don't know at all after leaving their body you understand what i'm speaking one seek nature one one just taking one seek nature from a very old vishnu for 3 days is not at all giving uh, food uh, prasadam to him just giving lock and key to him he is actually topmost param vishnu and he is giving that to that paramhans vishnu not at all giving any brahma prasadam everything he stopped in the lock and key if he will sign then only he can give prasadam you just sign it that's it i am i'll become ravan you just please to sign it i'll become ravan if you will not sign then definitely i will not to be you will be just stay like that you just uh, will stay like that in this condition okay so this is the actual which are of all this material what to do the at the lotus feet of maya devi that crores and crores of people actually are putting dandwa on the lotus feet of maya devi on to the lotus feet of maya devi crores and millions and millions of dandwa they are actually putting why because it is impossible it is not at all uh, impossible for maya devi to do anything everything is possible for maya devi so those who are actually discussing karm karm charcha maya, maya yog charcha and brahma charcha discussing that they are actually uh, having this ego on them but according to our gaudi darshan what is that they don't have any kind of false ego at all inside them this is the actual vichar of vaishnav that in one book actually a very small book i am actually writing on this 
this uh, it will be in english you can just get it in bengali as well so very nice book it is so maybe today i we have to stop up till today the actual which are i have to just give it uh, rest up till this point why because other katha also is there and other seva is also there so what is the actual conclusion up till that point we will, on pure guru vaishnav and bhagwan on that chinta shakti of bhagwan guru vaishnav we are not at all having confidence on that 100% we are not at all having getting that achinta uh, shakti sampann bhagwan we are not at all feeling confident on to him up till that point we are not at all doing up till that point to get into entry into the prakriti jagat it is not at all possible at all and in that case it is not at all possible to get the actual news of that prakriti so up till today we will be just discussing up till this point you just forgive me what i have to do just forgive me गोलको नामनी निजधामनी तले चतस्यो देवी महेशो हरिधाम सु तेषु तेषु ते ते प्रभाव निचया भीतश्च जेनो गोविंद मादि पुरुषम तमहम भजामी वांचकल्पतुरुष के पास इंदु पतितानं पावन वैष्णवयो नमो